right here. And let me just first say that was a quite a good uh, productive uh, community day thing. So like, uh, as you see, I actually did manage to catch a shiny within well, my first shiny within the first um, what's it five or ten minutes, which was you know pretty awesome since I normally am not actually out of the house until around 11-ish, and I actually was out around the start, which is 10-ish. So um, as you see, this is one of the ones that I caught. Um, if you notice the trend, I'm naming most all of my shinies, at least these ones so far, after random characters from uh, Naruto that I think would suit them. Because, well, I'm geek and, uh, yeah. Anyway, so... I did catch more than this, but uh, I did kind of transfer them because I needed the candies. Which is, I'm um, just commiserate myself now, I, I was 22, I think? 22 candies short from evolving it into a Charizard. I mean, 22. Hmm. Slightly annoying, but since when I came back home I didn't actually go back out because it would be, you know, a hassle and everything, so... Um, Oh, there we go. I must wait until some other time when it's available so I can evolve it. But, as you see, in total I have three shinies. I think. Is that three shinies? No. There's two shinies and one was a, uh, one of my first one Charizards I caught. But I think I transferred that and, uh, renamed that one onto a different, uh, Charmander that was, uh, had a higher CP anyway. So, um, this is my second shiny. Um, yeah. Then this was my first shiny at the time I evolved it into a Charmeleon, which I don't really like the look of Charmeleon very much, but there we go. And it's quite good that it's a 994 CP, which is, you know, maxed out. Um, yeah, I think I retook the screenshot with all of the, uh, names properly. Well, actually, no, because I transferred the 45 and, uh, renamed the top one. So, yeah, just a random thing. And as you see, I had 78 candies and I only needed 100, so... 22... Missing. Less. Yeah. That was, like, similar to what happened to my Bulbasaur one. I didn't catch enough. <laughs> but surprisingly, there was quite a lot of Charmanders around Tesco's. Because, like, that was pretty uh, interesting. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's basically the productive... Thing I did after the uh, royal wedding breakfast thing that I went to, which was nice, because, like, I had nice food. Um, I guess I could put a picture in it, maybe, if I remember. If not, then it was just fried potatoes, bacon, eggs, sausages, and I put pepper on it, because I needed some spice. Um... Yeah, that, that's basically it. I guess I'll put in a uh, code. I think I put this code in a different video before, but just in case if you missed it, here's a code that I got from the newsletter, which has to be used by the 30th of June. So that's for a free Forbidden Light Booster Pack, I believe. So uh, go ahead and use it. Don't know how many times you can actually use it or how many people can use it. So go ahead and use it. <laughs> Um, yeah, so that's it. So, thank you for watching slash listening. Over now.